Collins Sabatco Club. We're based in Nuneaton. Um, the club started in 1999. I've been a member there only for about five years. Um, I'm currently chairman uh, for my considerable sins. Uh, so we're we do quite a lot of training. Um, we're quite a small club, only 22 members, so we have quite a high um, number of uh, kind of junior divers, and then a core of uh, core of divers that actually go diving rather than training. Um, but the, the, the aim of the training is obviously to go diving, and that's what we're here doing today. Um, so we're at Newbold Quarry in Rugby. Um, we've chosen this location partly because it's somewhere to dive that's different, um, which is why we enjoy it. Um, but also there's some, you know, it's a nature reserve, there's, there, there used to be crayfish here, but um, we haven't found any yet today. Um, and also to kind of clean up litter. I think at the beginning of the dive it's all exciting, your heart starts racing as you're about to either jump in the water and then as soon as your head hits under the water you're relaxed and everything sort of drifts away, you can just concentrate on what's in front of you and where you're going and it's a sort of, it is really a nice a quiet environment really and, uh, and you can just enjoy all the sights and sounds that are down there. It's like being on a different planet, you know, because it's most people see what's on the top, but very few people get to see what's underneath, and it's so, so different. It's just seeing um, the life in its, its own habitat, and it's not like being in a forest where wildlife runs away from you. When you're in the water, it's there. It's not scared of you. You can swim right up to it, and they're fine with that. But um, it's just completely different, completely different from being on land. Best memories, probably, Kind of seeing sharks in the Red Sea. Just kind of awe inspiring, it's kind of just a wow moment. That's what it's all about, it's getting those wow moments. So.